to my gamer, and today we're gonna be talking about uh, which are better, di uh, discs or cartridges. So which is better? Which is more durable? We'll be answering these questions and more in the first episode of Which is Better. Okay, so uh, basically we started out with cartridges. Um, oh yeah, little disclaimer before this. My first episode I did this, but I w I just had to go to the bathroom and I wanted to make it quick. So I'm going to redo it, so this is going to be like the real one, so, <laughs> cartridges. They were before discs, um, they were what were more producible at the time because they didn't really have like laser technology back then, so we had cartridges. Uh, so this is a Game Boy Advance cartridge, uh, you just slide it in and it works. And then you also have like SNES, N64 cartridges, and cartridges are, m I mean, uh, N64 cartridges are my favorite. So yeah, you just like pop them in and then they work fine. Usually they're made out of uh, pretty durable plastic actually. Like you have to try really hard to break them. I mean like you don't want to, but eventually you could. Uh, sometimes you do have to like blow into them to get the dust out, but make sure your breath is dry or else it'll ruin the game with your moisture. So yeah, there's like SNES, Atari 2600, NES, and uh, N64 ones. There's a lot of them, Sega Genesis. So yeah, and then GBA, and the only real thing that things that are using cartridges now these days are 3DS ones, which are really the same as DS ones. And so, uh, do I have it? No, I don't have it. And so yeah, DS ones are like pretty small. So it's like half the size of this, like that, and then like half the width. So yeah. Um, next up we have discs. Oh yeah, some pros are that they're pretty big so like some uh that's both good and bad because like it may need to fit them into a box or something but you can find them easier and like you can't fit them into a tight space and that's the same thing with uh well like yeah one second uh like uh because you just pop them in and then you can see what you're playing when you're playing it like you can't do that with discs like because it has the label on it when it's out except for on the nes like on the Sega Genesis, uh, Atari, um, N64, you can see what the other person is playing, or like what you're playing if for some reason you forget. And then discs. Some pros are that, um, they're really thin, so you can like fit them like, uh, in a box, but you can also lose them really easily because, um, uh, beca um, because like they're really thin and small, kind of. So yeah, right here I have a PS1 car um, disc, and this one has a black back. So yeah, and then GameCube games are probably the smallest ones because they're about like like about this big around, but like the same little hole. They were the first um, Nintendo disc, so then they made the Wii and the Wii U, which had like real discs, quote. So yeah, like they use laser technology with like a little camera or eye in there. So like yeah, but you can't see what they're playing or what another person is playing. But also another thing. So uh, Ace Gamer said that they get scratched. Yes, they do. The new ones, and by that I mean PS3, PS4 games, uh, are blue have Blu-ray technology where they use a special chemical like that's really that's cheaper to make. Um, and then like they put it around the disc and it can't be scratched. Like I've literally tried to scratch it and it's it's hard to like. Do I have any over here? No, I'm afraid not. No. Nope. Anyways, well, yeah, they're like really durable, so yeah, like they can't really get scratched. So yeah, thanks to Sony for that. Xbox doesn't have that. So yeah, uh, another thing is that um, if you lose them, then like he said, uh, you don't have to go on a Zelda quest to find them. But so yeah. But all in all, really that last reason what I said, the PS3 and PS4, like Blu-ray thing, that's why I like, di um, that's like really one of the only good things about it. So I like cartridges better too, because like, they don't get scratched and they're pretty big so you can find them easy, uh, as easy, so like, yeah, and then you can also like put them up, like, you can't stand a disc up like you can with a cartridge, like, um, you can't go like that with a disc, because they're so thin, but like you can with a cartridge, like, uh, like see, you can just like balance it on something, see like that, so like if you're making a video or something, then you can just like put it like that, so yeah, uh, I think our, 
um, the verdict in this episode of which is better are trusty cartridges. Plastic filled with little circuits and things like that. Uh, they help us play our games. And then discs with the laser technology of thin metal sort of thingies with chemicals in it to keep it from scratching. Like, comment, subscribe. Hope you enjoyed. And be sure to check out uh, our, our new episodes of Which is Better coming out soon. Bye-bye.